Now the horse is your default mount and basically it's kind of fast and it can jump uh, over mountains more or less but it can really compare to the other mounts in terms of well their abilities for example when it comes to the big big uh, this one can fly and basically you don't get full damage but you can always float and you can still climb uh, mountains and other type of uh, hills and stuff without actually any problem the Brilliant Beetle is probably the best among all of the mounts because it easily climbs mountains uh, with ease compared to some of the other ones that might have troubles uh, climbing some of the different terrain. It can still fly uh, and get pretty far uh, with its uh, floating, as you can see. We're going to compare it, of course, to the to the Big Beak as well. And the Big Beak has a kind of a seems like a slight advantage, but considering the fact the other advantages that the Brilliant Beetle has. Uh, including its ability to move faster over water and climb uh, structures for, guess, for example like walls uh, which is great for PvP which the other ones can't actually climb just give us a big advantage over the other mounts. And I'm going to show you more examples you can see how actually versatile this mount is in different type of uh, kind of topographies and uh, climbing structures. So this one, for example, how to climb this structure? Maybe an enemy is running after me, but I want to put something there. Very easy with the beetle. Now let's try with the big big. Well, notice it's not possible, but it's very annoying and you need to be quite accurate to where to find the place to actually land. And if you don't have really have it, well, it's going to be a bit hard, as you can see. What's tough. So with the horse, of course, well, forget about it. Well, the horse, as I told you, is just the worst among all of them. I don't even, I don't even want to continue. But again, look at that with the beetle, puk, puk, and you're up. And of course, you shouldn't forget the regal tiger, which is the fastest among all of them on the ground, uh, not on the water. And the water is the beetle, and still, even with that, is uh, yeah, it's pretty hard to jump with it. It has very good, by the way, jumping, jump from peak to peak uh, when it comes to mountains and high elevations. But overall, you can see it's a problem. So let's see uh, how they jump. So this is, as you can see, a pretty good jump. Let's check the beetle. Not really good jump, even with the floating. It's okay. And with the horse, well, nice jump. But again, as I told you, it's kind of a okay. And with the Big Big, as you can see, it can actually float, so it's very easy to traverse fast if you're jumping. And yeah, really nice, huh? Now, when it comes to flying, uh, it's more or less, uh, more or less the same. I'm just going to show you Big Big compared to the Beetle. <laughs> it's like walking on air. As you can see, really nice distance. And let's try the Beetle, the brilliant Beetle. Again, this is with extra speed. If you don't uh, add speed, it's going to fly last. So make sure to add it. Nice, huh? Well, this is the same. Now, on water, I told you that the Brilliant Beetle is the fastest, and it is. It's not a huge margin, but it is fast. So this is the real Tiger and the Big Beak. Yeah, it's faster, no doubt. Look at that. Much faster. Now, the reason I told you uh, in PvP why uh, the beetle is great, I told you uh, uh, already that it's very, very good when it comes to traversing terrain. But if you try to just get out of this, for example, of this wall with the beetle, it's a piece of cake. Even if there are lots of obstacles, you can easily jump over the walls. But if I try with the horse or any other mount, I just can't. But with the horse, by the way, if you get a high jump and you get the wheel, uh, the speed width, you can do some really crazy jumps. Same goes, by the way, to the other ones. But uh, again, if you just want to have fun and get the higher jumps, make sure to get the width and those uh, red platforms that give you higher jump. You can find them both on top of mountains, on the ground. So basically, if you're on the mountain and have kind of a bad, uh, bad mount that can really do a good jump, make sure to take it so you can easily traverse through the high ground between mountains and hills. As you can see, the 
Beetle, the Brilliant Beetle is by far the best, can traverse better than any other mount. It's the fastest on water. It's very good compared even to the big big one flying. It's not fastest as the as the um, tiger on ground, but still very very fast. And overall, yeah, just does everything else better. And yeah, this is uh, my favorite one, and I think the best mount so far, unless the developer will add more in the future. And you can also see that it's better even for PvP with all of the things said, and also the ability to traverse upon walls and other type of structures very fast with even just not putting any effort into it compared to the other mounts. And that's about it. Are you finding this one useful? Uh, give a like if you did. And if you have any questions, let me know in the comment section below. Don't forget to subscribe. And uh, yeah, there are other guides coming. So make sure to check, out, check them out. I'll see you on the next video. Thanks for watching, everybody. Cheers.